Hello friends, today we are going to see how to rotate a linked list around a node. So here is the example. So we are asked to rotate this linked list around node D. So this means that the nodes which are coming after D, these nodes E, F, G, H. So these nodes will go to the beginning and the last node of this linked list will point to the will point to the starting node which is why this is called as rotating the linked list. So the answer will be E F G H and A B C D. So this is the answer E F G H A B C D and it will be connected to null. The last the D will will be connected to null. So now let us see how to do this. I will tell you uh, this is the same example. Now let us see what we have to do. So the first and obvious thing is we have to reach to the node. So if this is the function head is given and we will be given the node R. This is the given node that is D means around that node we have to rotate the linked list. So D is the node. So from head of this linked list we have to reach to D. So let us start. So in this code you can see P is the pointer which will point to head. Okay. So now P will reach to the rotating node. So R. So while P is not equal to null we will make P is equal to P points next. So we will go up to D and when the rotating node matches P. So when P points D that is R. This is also R. This is the given node. So then we will break. We will break out of this while condition. And after we break. So we, our P is positioned at R that is the node D. So our new head, new head is this node that is E. So in this linked list our new, no, new head is the node next to P which is why new head is P points next. So we assign it as the new head. So this node is called as new head p points next then we will then there is one more condition which is necessary we have to reach to the end of this linked list because when we reach the end node of this linked list then we will connect the end node to the head of this linked list so that we can rotate this linked list so we point this node that is the new head to Q means Q is the pointer which will point to E and in again in this while loop we will reach to the end of this linked list. So while Q points next is not equal to null till H the node next that is E's next is F, F's, F's next is G, G's next is H but next of H is null. So when it will come to H, H points next is null. So this condition will fail and we will come out of this while loop. And now Q points next equal to head. Here is the thing when we come to H then the next pointer of H will point to the head node. So this is how we rotated the linked list. Now a very very important point here is that when we made this as new head we have to break this link. 
we have to break this link and we have to make it as the end of the new link list so we have to make next pointer of d as null okay and this is our new head e is our new head and d is our last node now we have made the next pointer of d as null okay so this is how we rotate the link list around a node hey friends please subscribe to my channel as i post algorithm videos every day and if you want a video on any particular topic then please mention in the comment below thank you